Welcome back to One Piece and before I announce basically before I say what, what part this is, uh, I'm doing a there's gonna be a slight change. Um there's not gonna be a part nineteen E. I've decided to clearly for the review of the uh, eight specials in the Straw Hat Theater, I'm gonna do that plus the plus the ten many films in a series of specials. Because right now I'm basically this is gonna be just part twenty and this is just gonna be from this point forward just reviews of the actual anime just the uh, regular episodes this one is called um, this is episode 806 and this is basically power of sanity a new gear form tank man yeah Luffy gets another uh, form to debut in this particular saga this is basically gear form this is not the original one this is this this is like mark two of it and it's tank man and it's quite large. Now, up to this point, uh, he had been eating up a lot of the Biscuit Warriors, which had been coming out like crazy because, well, Cracker kept doing and doing doing those clap and bring out a bunch of Biscuit Warriors. And what did Luffy would do with these instead of smash them? He just ate them like crazy. He got so freaking big. It was a couple points basically he was going to explode, and yet Nama kept feeding him stuff for some reason, and then he became the Tank Man, basically went to Gear 4, and went Tank Man, and punched him basically to where he threw, he threw him pretty much like halfway across the island, basically landing directly into uh, the whole Castle Island Chateau, which is basically Big Mom's castle. Basically, it looks like he threw him, basically the big punch he hit him with, it looks like it threw him 10 freaking miles. Yeah, that's what it looked like, 10 freaking miles. I don't know how big, how wide... Uh, whole cake island is but he threw him pretty far mm -hmm. and uh, of course Santa goes off in this carriage just to lead up until next week's episode which is basically uh, the 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 one-way duel between uh, Sanji and Luffy that, that's gonna be next week uh, this is something that people this is something I, I had heard they were going to do I kind of suspect this because well yeah now this episode I think was adaptation of chapters uh, 843 and 844. Um, of course, Chopper and Carrot are still in Mirror World. They do eventually find the mirror that has Sanji in it, but, but, but they couldn't get to him because Sanji uh, dropped that gorgeous sister, basically just have to be walking by. And is it just me? I mean, yeah, I get the fact she's supposed to be a few version of Sanji, but does she have to have her hairstyle to be exactly the same as Sanji's? Basically, we're covered up one eye. Yeah, and even when their children basically wear... Uh, where they were children, it comes up the right eye, and when they're adults, at this point, they're covering up the left eye for some reason. No idea why. That just happened the way it is. Um, of course, Sanji is still wearing his poofy shirt. Yeah, and also because in the, I think it was in the previous episode, Sanji's brothers basically beat the living crap out of him, basically swell up his face. So, his sister decided to help him out. By giving him sort of a facial mask to wear, so he can look good in front of his, uh, in front of his fiance pudding, which she is a lovely woman. I gotta hand it to that. I gotta hand it to that. Though they don't show it off here per se, but they do show off later in the manga, where she her she has the free ability, just like the rest of her siblings and her mother. Her free ability, she can rewrite memories. And she can uh, have a third icon on her forehead. They haven't shown it yet. My guess is that's going to be shown in a future episode. My guess is about two or three episodes from now. Who knows? Excuse me. Of course, next episode is basically definitely going to be when Luffy and Sanji fight each other. That's what happens next episode. As a matter of fact, this is also the name of an actual uh, manga book. Yep, Sanji versus Luffy. It's, uh, if I can get to it, it is book, um, I think it might be book four, if I'm not mistaken, I think it is, let's see, it is book, uh, hmm, once it comes up, there we go, it is book, uh, 84, yep, 84, so, right now at this point, um, so with this, I think that it looks like they, they look like, even though that A44 is basically Luffy and Sanji fight each other, 
From what I can tell, this episode probably just adapt just one chapter, and of course they say probably the next couple chapters. So, at this point, they're only about halfway through Volume 84 right now. Um, and this season started with Book 83, 82. That's where it started with. And now we're on Book 84, which the book has not been released here yet. Um, yeah, the book is not supposed to be released until here until November. Yeah, we have to wait pretty much three months for the next release. Which honestly really makes no sense. Excuse me. But yeah. Um, it was a pretty good episode. Uh, just just basically like ending the fight between L Luffy and Cracker. Uh, a little bit of advancement on uh, Chopper and Carrot though in the manga. They're actually already out of Mirror World. Uh, I'll, I'll get to the manga chat that, that came out yesterday in a minute. But it's a good episode nonetheless. Uh, next week's episode, it's titled A Heartbroken Duel, Sanji vs. Luffy, Part 1. I have heard that next week's episode, I think it's next week's episode, either either it's uh, this coming Saturday's episode, either it's next Saturday or uh, Sunday or the following Sunday, where it's going to be an hour-long episode. Um, I don't know when, but I have heard that was basically how it was promoted, because uh, there's going to be a one week where... Uh, One Piece is going to get a week off, and uh, DB's uh, Dragon Ball Super is going to basically have one week where it has two episodes aired the same week, and then like the following week basically be uh, One Piece, uh, where One Piece airs its um, hour-long episode. Yeah, the way, the way the time slot is in Japan is that Super comes first, then One Piece. Um, I don't know what channel is on here. It's probably on Adult Swim. Though, knowing Adult Swim, they're probably on, like, past midnight. Which, by the way, hardly anybody stays up that late to watch TV anyways. Unless, of course, they work really late. Um, good episode. Now talk about the ep the manga chat that came out yesterday. Me. I'll get my thoughts on this one. This is chapter uh, 879. The cover chapter is simply put, another one of the, talk about the, the Straw Hat Fleet. Uh, basically, Sai getting the crap beat out of him by his ex fiance And, of course, his grandfather just sits standing there, still with his uh, drill head thing still bent. I'm like, um, couldn't he just fix it himself? I mean, yeah, the drill, head, the drill thing was bent. Yeah, Sai did that himself. Couldn't he just fix it? I mean, at least it's not gone. It's still there, just bent. Um, but, yeah. It focused a lot on basically what's happening on the ship. Uh, the Strya crew just getting away on the Thousand Sunny, while Luffy, Luffy does not, Luffy barely appears in this chapter. He does appear like to like the last page, which I'm like, okay, I don't really get why. I mean, yeah, the end of the previous chapter basically showed, yeah, maybe this chapter is going to show off that fight. Nope, this fight, th this fight is going to be delayed for another chapter. It's like, oh, we set up this this fight at the end of the previous chapter, and this ch this chapter maybe maybe we're going to show the fight. Nope. We kind of basically have the have the last page pick up right where the last page of Peter's chapter leaves up with the mirror being smashed and looks like they're about to start fighting. I'm like, seriously? Why in the world would Oda do this for? This is so stupid. But it's a pretty good uh, chapter. It basically has all the characters. Even looks like Gene Bay is on the, on the Thousand Sunday. I think this is actually the first time. He, this is actually the second time he's been on the Thousand Sunday. Uh, the last time he stepped foot on the ship itself... Was there in Fishman Island briefly, but now he's officially part of the crew. Um, but there's a rumor I've heard. Uh, King of Lightning basically mentioned this in his re his recent reviews that possibly the carrot might join the crew. I personally wouldn't mind that. I think she's a great character. She's interesting, funny, and she's she's a good fighter. But as what position would be on the crew? Kind of the same thing with Jean Bay. What is his position going to be on the crew? I mean, yeah, he's an ex warlord. I mean. Two like positions you have in the crew: you have Luffy, who's the captain; uh, Zoro's the swordsman; Nami's the navigator; Robin's the archaeologist; Brook is the musician, though he's also a swordsman; uh, Chopper is the doctor; uh, Usopp is the sniper; Sanji's the cook. Um, let me think. Yeah, that's it. I mean, there's like nine. Well, with Jinbei joining the crew, that makes ten. Uh, I would say he could be like the the trainer of the crew, and uh, training how people to fight. But here's kind of the weird thing. Um, he's actually a really damn good fighter. Uh, it's shown up basically both in Marine Ford and Fishman Island, where he actually can hold his own pretty well without any weapons. 
And his weapons are his hands. Basically, he knows Fishman Karate. And also, he's probably the only person in, in the... Probably, well, officially now joining the Straw Hat crew. He's the only one who actually wears sort of a Japanese-style uh, dress. Basically, like a Komodo in a way. He's the only one who actually does wear that. He's kind of big and beefy, but... He's the first... He's, he's actually the second non-human to join the crew. Uh, first one since Chopper. Well, Carrot might join the crew, but... She's a mink. So, you have... All where we look at the whole crew, you have... Uh, basically, you have... Seven humans, a skeleton, a reindeer, a fishman, and possibly soon, uh, a mink. Which I personally think is a great idea. Uh, I do agree with that assessment. I think one person could join the crew if, let's say, if they ever wanted to do anything more with this character. Was that head chef who worked for the, the Volsmoke family who uh, Sanji protected. And basically, her brothers, her, one of her brothers basically beat the crap out of her. Though, in the anime, that it, her face is not as swollen as it was in the manga. Uh, my guess is they probably don't want to show it because probably little kids probably want to watch, watch, watch this thing. I mean, yeah, this woman got beat up, fine. But I don't think they ever want to actually show a woman getting beat up in the anime. That's just my personal guess, anyways. Um, what else? Uh, I wouldn't, yeah, I wouldn't mind she joining the crew. Uh, wouldn't it hurt to have an extra, uh, have a, have Sanji get an extra pair of hands. I mean, yeah, it's another woman. I mean, I mean, overall, basically, she'd be like, well, the fourth woman to join the crew. Because you have Nami, Robin, potentially Carrot, and maybe this, uh, Cassette, basically. She's, she's there's not much to the character, but I kind of like the character. So, this is a character I personally do want to see more often, because she's interesting, and she has, well, you know, yeah, she has a thing for Sanji, but... Yeah, probably for Nami, basically, be a distraction for her, so basically Sanji's not trying to put the moves on her constantly, and trying not to peek at her, basically, when she's taking a bath, though. Uh, he has done that once before. Mm -hmm. And he got fried for him and Brooke. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. Uh, that's it for this episode. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. I'm doing another comic corner today, because I, I got a couple more trades done. And the two Marvel trades, but it'll be surprised basically what Marvel trades they are. Um, but yeah, next week will be uh, part 21, basically discussing the 807 episode, A Heartbroken Duel, Sanji vs. Luffy, part 1. Okay, but until then, I will see you there. Bye.